is 809. Want to get over to meteorologist Katie Sunika, who's yeah. talking about a drizzly start to the day, but her seven day forecast is looking pretty good. I know. It's been the buzz. The, the confidence yes. is growing that this week is not going to be like that carrot. Do you remember the carrot that was dangled? Yeah, I like remember. Week after week, this one. Now we saw it. We didn't say anything. And then we got a little closer and we're like, okay, maybe we can say something now. Let's wait one more day. We got another day. It got stronger and it has increased in strength for the chance to hit our first 70 degree day. We just have to get through a couple of additional days that look a little more like this. Not all day. In fact, we're starting to see things clear up. This is even clearer than the last time I checked out there at that Tillicum Crossing, the Rivermark camera. On the radar, not much has changed this morning. We pretty much have just seen those little drizzles in that northwest corner. Once things clear up, we should be dry for the most part all the way through today until we get to tonight. That's when the rain chances start. Hey, it's me. How about this? How about we take a look at what the day is going to be like? It's mainly dry. That slight chance of showers we've had this morning, and then we're dry pretty much until the p.m. Temperatures are going to be the warmest we've seen in several days. Then once we get to tonight, we will see that chance for rain to come back. So here's where we are. We have got about just a little more than four and a half inches so far this month. La typicals around two, so obviously we beat that by crazy much. And then last month at this time, not quite as much, but guess what? We have more dry streaks coming, where at this time last year, we were seeing heavier rains come. Now we're starting to see things clear up, and we might not even have any more rain. If we watch, you can see I mentioned some tonight, through tonight, into tomorrow. A few drizzle chances throughout the day, a little more tomorrow than today. And then that rain returns Sunday night into Monday, brings back a chance for some snow on the Cascades, but snow levels are high enough that when we get the snow on the Cascades, it's not supposed to be here with us. And this is what I'm talking about. You see the snow levels go up off the charts. That's that ridge, that chance I was telling you that's been building in, getting stronger and stronger. Today, we do make it to at least average, if not a few degrees warmer. 62 is average and 66 is what we're expecting. But here is what Deb was talking about with our seven day. The ridge starts to build late on Monday and gets going on Tuesday, gets us back to our first 70 degree day since October, continues to build more and more and more, brings in more warm air. And right now we look like we could just touch the bottom of those 80s on Friday this next week. Deb.